I presume your stubborn and unforgiving father is unaware of your party plans? He's gonna be in Dubai. Oh. Please come. To chaperone a bevy of Gen Zers? No thanks. You'll hardly be a chaperone. <laughs> Maybe you'll meet someone, unless you can bring that plus one. I think I'll steer clear of romance with 18-year-olds. So you're not seeing anyone? Spencer? I'm serious about that party, though. You know how your father can be. So... You said your mother didn't tell you about the affair. So how did you find out about it? I overheard Miss Henry unloading on my mom about it. Then, not too long after, Miss Henry had a stroke. She's gonna be okay, but the whole thing is just a mess. I can see how it, it seems that way. Especially because you're at the heart of it. Which means if you want things to get better... Which I do. Well, then you've got to be the one to start making them better. Go and, and see your mom and talk to her. I don't know if I'm ready to do that. We well, don't have to be ready. Not right this minute. But soon, okay? Because I've learned the hard way that we cannot let things like this fester. We need to set things right as soon as we can. Well done. Tell me all about your broken heart. <laughs> Sharing is healing. Uh, <clears throat> I will share this with you. Your back says, kick me. Huh? <laughs> Who was the last person to put sunscreen on your back? Trina, <laughs> when did you get here? You know, from this angle, it kind of looks like it says, kiss me. <laughs> Are you sure that truth is, now that my father is on the way to the Emirates, I have to finish with the party plans. You kids have fun. I mean it, Brett. Please come. It'll heal what ails you. Oh, uh, you know, I've always been a physician heal thyself kind of gal. Mm, how's that working out for you? We should...